Hey, what's going on, guys? I want to thank y'all for tuning in with me, John and Jay, for another Let's Talk Stock video. Today, we're going to be going over three stocks that I am in for long term. I'm still nibbling into them, getting better positions. Every time they drop below my average cost, I will be buying more of those stocks. So, you guys, just stick around. I got a lot to go over. You guys, do me a favor. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. It'll really help out the channel a lot. Also, you can leave a comment down below. Give me a few tips on anything you guys want me to go over or get any questions you want answered. Also, I have two links down below. Well, I have three links down below if you guys want to get some free stocks. I have for Robinhood, Webull, and Coinbase. I do trade on all three platforms. Webull is giving out two free stocks. Once you deposit $100, you guys can use that. If you want to get into trading early and trading late, I think you can get in. Start trading on Webull at 3 a.m. You start trading at 7 p.m. So it's real good if you guys want to catch some of those stocks that's running up pretty high early in the morning before the market opens at 8.30. You can go ahead and purchase those through Webull or if you guys just want to wait to 8.30, you can purchase there. But you should really take advantage of the Webull uh, free stock right now. All right, the first stock that I have that I'm doing long term is Plug Power. I know I've been mentioning mentioning to you guys about Plug Power for a little bit over a month now. I recently just started to grab positions in this stock. As you see, I only have 16 shares, but as it goes below my average cost, which is $37, I will be buying more. I had Plug a few months ago around $17. I rolled it up and cashed completely out. I just got back in recently after you know, of course, the stock market had this big dip maybe sometime last month or a few weeks ago. So, like I said, I have 16 shares of this with a, with a market value of $16.16. I also do calls on this one. I do a call on this one maybe once a week, if not every other week. But most likely, I've been doing it once a week for the last three weeks. I get in it. I get up to at least... 50 to 70 percent and I jump out let the stock fall back down some buy another contract I have been buying contracts right around the 34 35 dollar mark and just ride them up as you see I do have a contract right now with a value of 523 dollars right now I have a total return of 168 dollars which is equivalent to 47 percent like I said, so I'm gonna see how this stock goes tomorrow. I might just cash out if it gets below 35. I might just cash out or I can just ride it all the way out to Friday. Now another one that I have that's long term for me is XPing. I only have three shares. I just recently got into this today. I did buy two contracts last Friday that's gonna end this Friday as well with plug power. I only have three shares with an average cost of $38.09. I will be buying more of this as well. Grab a few shares here and there. I always nibble. I don't just go all the way in, go all the way in. And if stock goes down, you won't have any buying power to still buy the dips. So as much as this drop, I'll just grab another share here and there. Now I do have two option, options on here. Two contracts with a value of right at $400. A total of negative nine dollars, which is not bad because I just got into these today. Also, I have to Friday to make make up the the nine dollar loss. Hopefully, I can get into the sixty seven percent gain in this stock as well. And the last stock I have is SOS Limited. I love this stock. I try to buy as much of this as possible. Right now, I have sixty shares. With a market value of $414. Average cost in here is $5.93. My total return is a little bit over $58. Uh, I have done a call in this one a time or two. I didn't really just make big, maybe about 30-40%. I got out. Like I said, these three right here they are long term for me. Club, XP, and XO, SOS Limited. Alright guys, I want to appreciate y'all for tuning in with me. Hope all the information was useful. If you use that advice, hope you use it to your advantage. 
I'm not your financial advisor. I'm giving you stocks that I'm going over. I'm getting in. I will be better in our positions in. Making calls on them. I love making calls. Uh, to me, it's kind of a quick money if you get in it at the right time. Get up, let that stock go up a little bit just to accumulate some more money. Get out real quick. Don't be too greedy trying to stay in and hit two, three, four hundred percent. I mean, you can always just wait, catch another play, take that profit, get into another stock. I mean, you can do a lot with your gains from that particular stock. You don't have to go all the way in and try to reach for gold every time you guys get a contract. Alright, and with all that being said, you guys continue having great days. Hopefully tomorrow will be a better day, a much more green day than what we've been having in the past couple days. Until then, keep making money.